Welcome back to Barbecue Nation. I'm Ted Kane through at Hot Metro Finds, and today we are looking at Wixom, Michigan's Barbecue Blues Festival. We got some old familiar faces here. The Chef Noodles, he's working the grill, and he's got uh, quite a few good things there. He's uh, moved up the block from the, the popular place he was found over on Wixom Avenue, and he's actually further up the road now. So let's see what he has to say. <laughs> That's good. That's good. What do you got today, Chef? Got ribs, chicken, full pork, everything six bucks. All right. Six bucks and everything. Yeah. Now, Chef Noodles is pretty interesting out of all the barbecue guys here because he actually has all of these different types of woods. He's got cherry wood, apple wood. He does a slow smoke uh, flavor to his barbecue. It's very, uh, it, it's amazing actually. It really enhances the, the overall taste of it. We're also joined today by some newcomers on the block, and uh, such as Caddy Sue's uh, Barbecue. Now they don't have a restaurant, but uh, they've got some really, really interesting accents to their barbecue uh, flavor as well. And of course you've got Kaya Barbecue, which is a uh, Kaya Smokehouse, and they present this amazing barbecue, it's a blueberry barbecue sauce which I thought was really over the top. It actually saves me a trip from going all the way out to South Dakota because uh, that's where I first heard about this amazing sauce and it was being applied towards barbecue ribs by a couple of Native American guys. And they got an eatery out there. I was actually going to fly all the way out there just for that sauce. But now you can get it right here in, in Wixom. Commerce Township in, in Walt Lake, which is <laughs> which is definitely a lot closer than South Dakota. You're watching this amazing band here. If, if that guy seems a little familiar on the guitar, I do believe I've seen him play at uh, Oak Point Church Services on Sundays. He's quite the musician, very eclectic, very well uh, versed in, in music whether it be pop, music, uh, gospel, or um, in this case, blues. <clears throat> it's quite a shoulder. Going back to Chef Noodles, he's got some uh, some news coming up. There he is there. He's on 2051 North Wixom Road. He's definitely worth the drive. He's never gone out there to see him. He's famous for his uh, ribs, barbecue chicken, and his pulled pork. So. Do check them out. One more uh, pulled pork, please. Sure. Going back for round two here. Yeah. Got a new website. Let's see what he says. What makes your what makes your food so awesome? <laughs> just that just that love and you know the love all into it. That's all. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yes, sir. We got a new website too. It's chef chefnoodlesbarbecue.com. Like that. All right. Yeah. I believe this is the first annual Barbecue Blues Fest for the city of Wixom. And we're actually in the brand new, I, I call it brand new, little uh, little you know community area. It's actually built in 2005, right across the street from the Wixom Public Library and the police station. And to our left is a new Valari restaurant location. A lot of people come out for this event, and it's uh, just great to see the community get together. Celebrating all the great things that makes Michigan great. You're watching Hot Metro Finds. This has been Ted Can 2. Keep watching, and we'll see you online. Come on.
呢